Hope you met Ronald. He, he's such a sweetie. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Did you find any quantum? You've done it. My machine is finally full. Well, like I promised, here's the schematic for the Nuka grenade. You've sure earned it. If you find any more bottles, be sure and bring them by. I'll be glad to keep paying for them. Well, the stuff is so rare, I only know one. It's called Mississippi Quantum Pie. It's delicious. If you want me to make you one, I can. Just bring me some flour, vodka, and a Nuka Cola Quantum. I can whip it up in no time. Oh no, he's such a cutie pie. He never bothers me. Bye bye now. The purified water's killing all the Meyer Lurks living in the basin. Lucky me, I get to pull out the floaters and roast them. You may want to stand back, unless you've got a strong stomach.
Stay sharp. They're everywhere. What are you talking about, girl? I don't know anything about any of that. And, uh, what did you call it? An android? What's that? Fine, whatever. This android calls himself Harkness now. Comes in and wants a memory job. I took new memories and replaced his old ones. Don't believe anyone's done that before. Certainly not down here. That Commonwealth tech isn't all that fancy when it comes down to it. I'm also the only one in the wasteland with the skill and the nerve to perform facial surgery. That android flesh ain't so different than ours. You want proof? I documented the whole thing. So I could rub it in the face of Dr. Lee when I need to rankle her feathers. I hate that snooty bitch. That witch ruined my life, but you're right. Who gives a crap about any of that? You want your precious proof. It's all in my computer. Here's the password. See for yourself. Hell, just take these pictures and this holotape. Straight from the synth man's lips. Just don't go telling Harkness, though. He won't believe you anyway. And you really don't want to see him upset. He can be a bit inhospitable. Maybe I am. Maybe I'm going to have my android army rise up against you and your human ilk. <laughs> sorry. Oh, sorry I couldn't resist. I suppose you're right. But don't worry, I didn't really wipe his memories. I just buried them. But you can get them back. All you need to do is use the recall code. Just say to him, activate a321 recall code violet and that will activate the hidden subroutines ha. why do you think i wanted to crack open that commonwealth can opener to see what was inside there's stuff in there i'd only heard about and even then i didn't believe it i can see why that zimmer feller wanted him back so bad bunch of bleeding heart morons if you ask me they're going to get themselves killed one of these days and for what machine liberation but they have brought me some really interesting tech over the years so i guess they're okay and that android he was the chance of a lifetime most of it's blasted nothing just like here but there's talk rumors mostly about a place called the institute that's where Zimmer and that android came from. God knows what else they got going on in there, but it puts our tech to shame, that's for damn sure. And how? I am the only one in all of the wasteland with the skill and the guts to perform facial reconstruction, you know. Look, you're different from all those other jerk-offs, so I'll make you a deal. You want a little nip-tuck here and there? I'll do it for you. I'll get to hone my skill, and you'll get the best surgeon around. The likelihood of death by infection at my hands is only... Mm, 35%, let's say. So, what do you want to look like? Another satisfied customer. Don't let your guard down. Yes. 
I'm a little busy right now. Is there a problem? What's that supposed to mean? Look, kid, I don't have time for existential debate. And I'm not interested in whatever religion you're peddling. Excuse me? Look, kid, you have exactly five seconds to explain what you're trying to do here or you'll be leaving Rivet City by the way of the nearest porthole. All right, I'll humor you. But this is impossible. I can't be a robot, I'm a human being. I breathe, I eat. Hell, I cut myself shaving this morning. I was bleeding. Robots don't bleed. I'm not sure what to say. I'm not sure what to even think about all this. I'll admit this is pretty convincing evidence, but it doesn't make any sense. How can this be possible? Ah! Oh, my God. I, I remember. I remember it all from before. Zimmer, the Commonwealth, the Institute. My God. All those runners I brought down. You. You made me remember. Why? How? I... Never mind. I just... My God. What am I going to do? My life. Everything. It's all a lie. I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to shove him into a very small box and send him north where he belongs. Hmm. He is a security threat, isn't he? All right. I authorize you to carry out Dr. Zimmer's execution. Don't think this gives you license to run around shooting anyone you want. Just Zimmer. And that bodyguard, if he gets in the way. Here, use my weapon. I've had it forever. It's never let me down. Consider it a token of my appreciation. I don't know. 
Every time I retrieved one of the runaway androids, they'd fill my head with ideas about self-determination, freedom. At first, I resisted the ideas, but then I started thinking about it. And well, they were right. We're just slaves to them. We deserve lives of our own. So that's what I did. I chose a new life and gave up my old one. And now you've given me both to remember. Well, I'm not really sure. Look, just call me Harkness. That's who I am to the people on this boat who rely on me. It's who I am now. In fact, for everyone's sake, let's just pretend I've always been Harkness. We'll keep the truth a little secret between friends, all right? I have two sets of memories. One android, one human. Some of these are mine. Some belong to someone else. But I'm choosing to be human. It's my choice. The people on this boat look to me to protect them. So that's what I'm going to do. Carry on, then. Good to see you. Hmm. The sooner you find my property, the sooner I can get out of this slum. Really, how do you people live like this? Harkness, you say? Yes, yes, that makes sense. He used to work for a special branch of the Commonwealth Police, after all. And he's right here, in Rivet City? Excellent. I must wait, find an opportune moment to confront him. Thank you for your discreet assistance and continued discretion regarding this matter. And now for your payment. This combat module will directly affect your central nervous system. I think you will find it quite beneficial. What do you need? Are you certain? Very well. I shall return to my duties at the Citadel, should you require my aid once again. to see you.
Good morning, madam. What can I do for you? My humor emitter array requires recharging. I'll be sure and tidy up while you're away, madam.